in this video you're going to see water crossings, trails, waterfalls and awesome camping as we teamed up with go explore usa for a four day, three night trip through the ozarks. rooftop tent so I've been sleeping in the Jeep. There's really something peaceful about sitting by a river. Words, pictures, videos, just never do it justice. I'm using the Morphlate system to air down before we hit the trails tomorrow morning. We teamed up with Go Explore USA for this trip through the Ozarks. Brad and his team did an amazing job and served us the best nachos I've ever had on night one. We had a great night's sleep by the river, but it was time to grab the team, grab some breakfast, and hit the trails. I love hot chocolate in the morning and two shakes of cinnamon sugar. Here we're hiking back to some really cool waterfalls worth the hike.
We weren't expecting this washout when we started the trail, and there's a slight pucker factor here, but it was also kind of fun. That sounded way worse than it was. There was not a scratch on the Jeep. She did good. We tried to bypass a deep mud hole, got hung up on this tree, and we had to winch out. The bottom of the mud hole was soft and the water was deep, so we trenched it to lower the water level to make it easier to cross. Yeah, he'll get through it as long as he doesn't oh, stop. Man. Yeah, don't stop. Keep going. Keep going. Did you punch it all back? Yeah. Yep. Last night we got into camp after dark. I had no idea we were on a beautiful bluff. I got to see this first thing in the morning. Yeah, the only problem was it was so cold I couldn't feel my face. We made the most of it and had a really nice breakfast before hitting the trail. We finally reached Bub's cabin. And we got a party line, finally, and it was a 10 party party <laughs> line. So that's what I've seen in my time. And, and that's Bub. You know, party, party you got your nest right in your pocket, you know. So, so I mean, you tell I me. Mean, different world, different world. I am Frank. She let me come. What we lived in, you know, and yeah. We must have been tough when I was young. <laughs> if you ever get the chance to go see Bub's cabin, I highly recommend it. It's a really neat, preserved piece of history. We had a quick lunch before hitting the trails onto the next adventure.
after leaving Bub's cabin, we finally made it to the schoolhouse in the middle of nowhere. Built in 1929, this piece of history is worth checking out. Back on the trail with another beautiful water crossing, compliments of the Ozarks. Welcome to Car Wash Falls. After a long day on the trails, we finally made camp at this huge spot right on the river. Absolutely gorgeous. One of my favorite spots of the Ozarks. My Jeep camp setup is coming along great. And as always, I always recommend a camp shoe for comfort. It's another beautiful morning in the Ozarks, a very cold morning this time, but it was time to air up the tires with the Morflate system because we had two more waterfalls to check out. <laughs> And to end our four-day overlanding trip through the Ozarks was a waterfall worth the hike. I had to make one more stop on the way home to enjoy this beautiful area and have a little lunch. <laughs> 